This is Dave from Vintage Apparatus. This is the Curta Type 1 Mechanical Calculator. The Curta calculators were developed by Kurt Hertzstark in Vienna, Austria in the 1930s. The Curta comes in a metal canister. Unscrewing the canister and removing the calculator, it's ready for use. All that needs to happen is to open the reset ring and put it into position. The most notable component of the Curta is the crank handle on the top. This handle is used for all operations and always turns in a clockwise direction. The action is why these devices have frequently been referred to as a pepper mill. These numbers here show the counter. They represent how many times a calculation has been performed. Over here, these numbers represent the result. After each crank of the unit, these numbers are updated to reflect the ongoing result. On the front of the unit are the input sliders. This is where numbers are input into the calculator to be used in calculation. The Type 1 calculator has 8 input sliders and an 11-digit result counter. When starting a new calculation, the user resets the unit by pushing up here and spinning the clearing ring. This resets all the counters and the result is zero. Let's do a simple mathematical calculation. 415 multiplied by 45. To begin, we would set the input sliders to 415. Our tens position marker is set to 1, so we're adding 1 times the input on each crank. In this calculation, we need 5 ones, so we turn the crank 5 times. 5 times 415 is 2,075. Next, we'll need to multiply by tens, so we move the ring to indicate we're in the tens position, or 10 times the input on each crank. We're multiplying times 45, so the tens component is four. So we need to turn the crank four times. Okay, now we can see the result. 45 times 415, and the result is 18,675. These calculators are quite rare, and though this one is almost 65 years old, it still operates smoothly and cleanly. Doing addition, subtraction, and multiplication is relatively easy. Division is possible, but it's a little more complicated. For more videos about classic technology, click the like and subscribe buttons, or visit us on VintageApparatus.com.